take a ride, I can show you some Where you go, where you come from, baby Like my world says, look like bases We can be some, we can, we can be some You and me some, you and you and me some You and me some showing you guys my car so if you watch my 1000 subscriber q and you'll know that i got a car recently it's Renault Clio 2015 in this really nice green color and i'm going to show you guys around the outside and the inside and then i'll take you questions after too as i mentioned this is this, this really nice cream color i'll put like on screen the exact color it is because it's not white um but i think it's really unique because you don't see many cars this color and um it's just a car so it's got mirrors it's got wheels and if you come around the front and basically i had a i had a p plate here because i passed my test like two three years ago but i haven't driven in ages so i really wanted a p plate just to show drivers like i'm not an ex i'm not i don't really know what i'm doing but then i think didn't it fly off in the dual carriageway yes so that's quite nice there's also a little bit of bird food so please just come about and i'll show you guys the back it's got four doors so it's got a front door here and then a back door here but the the handle's kind of like hidden so you can't really see it, but I think that's quite nice because it looks a bit unique. And then yeah, show the back. And um, there is one to play on the back that managed to stay on on the dual carriageway. But the other one's gone. And yeah, I'll show you guys the boot as well. There's nothing like interesting inside. It's just got um, a spare tire in case you like break down, which could happen to me because that happened to me a lot with my last car and then like my cardigan that I wear sometimes. Um, I took it off because it's quite hot today, but yeah, I'll show you guys the inside now. So this is what the front looks like. Mom, if you want to zoom in a little bit. I'll give you guys like a close-up in a little bit as well. And um, this is what the back looks like. I think I mentioned earlier that the handles are really cool because it's got like, um, it's got the handles in a different place. We've got like a bag in there, but it's because we went shopping earlier. That's what the back looks like. Is this a five-seater or a four-seater? Five-seater. Yeah, I think I showed the boot earlier, so I'll show you guys inside closer up. So this is what the front of the car looks like when you're in the driver's seat. I got this little um, phone holder just to like hold my phone whilst I'm like using the sat nav and stuff. And then yeah, you've got all the little controls like heat and stuff. I've not used this much to be honest. Um, and then like the radio and stuff. And it shows you in really big letters like how fast you're driving, which I think is good. Um, and yeah, you've got two seats in the front. The design is quite strange because it's like got this um black mesh and then like red underneath so it's quite unique looks quite cool it has like a faded appearance um but yeah i guess it's kind of like sporty because it's got like the red there handbrake gears this is a manual car and then like it's got like, a really cool key instead of like a regular key it's like um like a card i'll show you guys later on and then yeah you just press start with your foot on the clutch to start the car so yeah that's a really good look inside the car i think what my mum and i are going to do now is um just probably drive somewhere it's actually hilarious how many people have like walked past <laughs> i literally saw my flatmate i saw a big group of boys and they saw me filming and i was like what the hell i guess we're gonna just stop now so i think we're just gonna go either to mcdonald's or just somewhere to get a drink and i'll probably bring you guys along i'll pop you in the phone holder and then yeah that'll be it do you wanna, do you wanna say hi this is my mum everyone she helped me film if you had to count how many people interrupted us filming, how I many? I would say we've had about 50. And it, like it felt like 50. It felt it's, like so many. No, seriously, because they've it has not been like just one person, one person. Yeah. It's been like two people or groups okay, of I'll people. Yeah, so go back a bit more. Is that, is that meant to be yeah. down? Yeah, yeah. Do I need to put... Are you down? in reverse? Yeah. yeah. That's fine. Now just spin. Yeah. That's it. Perfect. Keep, Let's keep it yeah, There's a couple of dodgy people down the road there. I'll let him go past. Do you think I should wait for her? You or might not? as well. Should I gesture? No, don't. You're okay. not supposed to. Are you not supposed to? You're not supposed to. If you do that in a driving test, you fail. Yeah. Okay. That's good to know. It might be a bit narrow where the bus is, so you might want to just, just wait. Her? Yeah. I've not stalled though, I'm quite You've proud. You've done really well, I've done yeah. really well. I think you're getting back into the, the gist yeah. of it. Yeah. It's like riding a bike, like once you get back into it, you remember. Because I know the first time we were in the car was a little bit like this. <laughs> Some of the time, like, ugh. I'm but not that today, bad. I'm more relaxed. No, I 
okay and um, so we're back in the car now i just wanted to answer a few quick questions that people might have like about the car and about like why i'm driving because um if you if you are a regular viewer you know that i'm like a medical student at newcastle and i didn't have a car for two years but going into my third year i do have a car now so i just thought i'd answer a few questions for people who might be curious about things um so yeah when did you start driving when did i start driving i started driving in year 13 of sixth form wait no year 12 of sixth form um just when most people start learning like i think you're 17 at the time i think that's how it's quite warm are you warm never mind i was like 17 or so um and i learned like all throughout year 12 and then i passed my test like just at the end of year 12 i think yeah oh i should probably say as well i've had this is my second car so i did have a car before and that was like um a red toyota Igo. if i've got a picture i'll put it on screen um that that was a nice car it was <laughs> that was a nice that was a nice first car my mom always said it was a good first car it broke down a couple times so why why didn't you drive uh, for over a year I didn't drive for over a year because, um, as I mentioned earlier, I passed when I was 17 and then when I was 18 I came to uni and I'm now 20 so I didn't drive because I was just at uni I didn't need to. Um, also insurance is really expensive so it didn't make sense to have a car sat at home insuring it when I'm not driving it. Um, it just made sense to get rid of my car that I had before, the red one, and then um, get a car now because I'll need one now. Now, yes. Okay. Is it quite far away? Okay, pause it and I'll have a look. Okay, you ready? I'm still not sure which person I'm This is meant to smell like cotton candy. Do you think it does? That was a nice that was a nice first car. My mum always said it was a good first car. It broke down a couple times. But yeah, I think and why why did it break down? Why did your mum get you that kind of car first as a first car? I don't know. Did she tell you? No. Because she wanted you to appreciate, appreciate. oh yeah. Say that <laughs> in there. So people know. So yeah, the car it wasn't it I I don't think it was a good car. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> I don't think it was a good car. But it broke you, down like three times. It did. Year. But you needed to have that car to understand the value, value. No, of a yeah, good I, car when you got yeah. it, and that was why I got yeah. you that car. My mum got it for me, so I would really appreciate like a good car like this one. Because <laughs> like driving this is so smooth, no issues. It's, it's like exactly, really nice. Exactly. So I really appreciate this. 